Made it up here with Melissa and Avery. Beautiful view up here. It's like a little two minute hike up here, no problem. But now we can see South Salungo, other mountains, Kibble Car and the Refugio, Sacheta, and then down into Val Gardena. Good afternoon. It is now almost two o'clock. We are here just below the Champinoy gondola. It's in a town that's like two towns up from where our hotel is. In order to say this is Selva. So we drove up here. Now we're gonna go up this gondola. You see right now it's perfectly sunny, beautiful weather. This morning was not at all. They were supposed to have a, the hotel organizes a barbecue up on Albatsuizi. So it was scheduled for today, but this morning we all woke up and it was cloudy and then it started raining. We waited for a little while and then they canceled it. So we actually just stayed at the hotel. Melissa and I did a workout. Avery went to the Lino Land daycare. She was there for about 45 minutes and then she didn't like it anymore. We took her back and then we hung out at the hotel. Now we had a little bit of a snack for lunch and now we did not realize it was going to be this perfect this afternoon. So we looked out, Avery's our little good luck charm. So we're gonna head up this gondola and see what we can see from up there. I checked. All right, there was a little bit of a nervous moment. Melissa went to do the ticket on the right side, like thing, and it said not valid here. And then she looked at me and was like, did you check to see if our ticket works here? And then I had a little bit of a nervous moment. Thankfully, we're at the wrong like gate thing. So now we're good. All right, first impressions off the gondola here. South Salungo, right behind. Covered a little bit by the clouds, but not too much. And then up here you get 360 degree views. So Sacheta is back that way. And then there's another, like, I think that's the Selva Group Mountains right there. Very impressive. You get 360 degree views of a lot of the stuff around here. So that in the distance there is Sacheta, where we were yesterday. So that right there, that little like dip in the mountain in the middle right there, that's where we were. And then all the other mountains behind it. So there is paragliding about to happen right here. So down below where the paragliders are, this is the Val Gardena. So this is the Gardena Valley. 
So down this way, if we can go down this way, a little further down, that's all the little towns along the way. I guess they're all kind of sort of connected. The biggest town down there is Ordese, right there. That's where we were staying, and then we drove up this way, down below to Selva, which is down there. Hi, Avery. How's it going? Over there, where there's the green between the mountains, that's the Gardena Pass. That's where you drive over the mountains into the valley. Okay, about five minutes, we're now just like a little walk down from the gondola. Is this viewpoint up here? Obviously can't take strollers up there, so I'm gonna go hike a bit. It's just a little hike, but obviously carrying a baby is a little bit different. So I'm gonna go test it out. And then Melissa's gonna wait down here with Avery. Made it up here with Melissa and Avery. Beautiful view up here. It's like a little two minute hike up here, no problem. But now we can see South Salungo, all the mountains, cable car and the refugio, Sacheta, and then down into Val Gardena. Make a hiker out of you yet. <laughs> She's like, Mama, I want to do it myself. So this gondola up here was a really good, quick little excursion. You probably only need 45 minutes to an hour up there. It's really a viewpoint. Basically, you kind of just walk around the top for a little bit. Hi, Avery. And then go up the viewpoint, get some nice photos of the 360 degree views back down to the valley of Sacheta, of these mountains back here. You can even see the Val Gardena Pass. And then you can even potentially see some paragliders, which we did, so that was awesome. Now we're headed back down, and since it's a nice day, there's another gondola that we can take so we can make the most use of our Valcordana lift ticket pass. It's called Co-Riser, so it's probably another five, 10 minutes back towards Ordesay, so that's where we're headed next. We made it up to the top of the coal riser gondola and we can see Sacheta is in the background back there. Oh, I guess that way. What I love about all these gondolas in the Alps are all these like just huts, bars and restaurants at the top. We can just have a drink and enjoy the view. And that's what a lot of people do. They just like ride the gondola up and they have like a meal up here and then have a beer or wine or whatever. And yeah, it's perfect. It's interesting, we just noticed that this hut down here has like farm animals. There's a goat or like three goats and then chickens back there. So that's pretty cool.
Hi, Avery. Did you enjoy the gondolas? Mm, yeah, okay. Good morning. We are here, still in Italy, still in the Val Gardena area, but we drove up to one of the most scenic areas in this whole area. It's called the Gardena Pass. So you have to drive up through this windy road and we made it up to the top of the pass and now we're going to take a chairlift 